having more single cool fun friends is a good thing for your love life. Losing the miserable single friends is a good thing for your love life. <laughs> right? Some of you have friends right now who are not helping you. They're the friends that when you go out, if you were to use this and be, go and talk to a guy, leave her on her own for a minute, you'd come back and she'd be like, why did you leave me on my own? What did you say to that guy anyway? Wasn't that embarrassing, talking to some random guy like that? Oh, is this something you learned on your seminar? <laughs> you don't need friends like that. Fine, if they're your friends, they've been your friends for 10 years. Okay, keep them, have fun with them, go to dinner with them, that's what they're good for, catching up. But don't take them to places where you actually wanna make progress. When you want to make progress, you need the woman who's banging on your door. When you're staying in watching Netflix, she's banging on the door saying, we are going out, woman. Get your shit. <laughs> and then when you go out, you go talk to someone and you play the violin coming back because you're like, oh my God, it was so embarrassing. It didn't go well. That guy, Matt Hussey, he gave me this stupid shit to do. And I feel embarrassed now. She just looks you dead in the eye and shouts, next! That's the friend that will change your life. So we need those people in our lives. We need those people in our lives. Sometimes the thing that's holding us back from our love life is not that we haven't met the one, it's that we haven't met enough new friends in a while.